It's not just the lights that brighten our city streets at night. Electric power is so essential today, it's hard to imagine life without it. Electricity is produced by a number of methods, one of them being hydroelectric generation. Conventionally, a dam is built to hold a large reservoir of water. The energy created by water falling from high to low levels turns the blades of a turbine. This rotates a generator to produce electricity. Recently, there's been a growing interest in smaller scale methods, using slight differences in the levels of flowing water. Underneath this bridge over a river in Tokyo, a small scale hydroelectric generator has been installed. Although the water drop is just one meter, this generates enough power to light the bridge. Enna is a city in Gifu in central Japan. Masaya Sumino, an engineer at a metalworking factory here, has developed a revolutionary water power generator that's gaining international attention. This is Sumino's ultra-small water power generator. A one meter by 28 centimeter casing encloses the spiral blades of the turbine. All flowing water has energy, and I always thought it was a shame that we weren't fully using this resource. That's what inspired me to come up with this concept for utilizing unused energy from nature. Weighing just 18 kilograms, this is the first ever generator of its kind that can be easily carried by one person. It's already being used in roadside irrigation channels to power street lights and for electrifying fences to protect farmland. To spread his message about water power, Sumino often gives presentations to primary school children like these. Today, he'll show them how to generate electricity from a small river in their school grounds. Okay, now I'm going to put it in the water. His generator works even with the gentle flow of this tiny stream. The spiral blades are angled, so they rise slightly towards the upstream side. A 15 centimeter high metal plate blocks the stream. This makes the water run over the top of the plate and flow down through the spiral blades. The force of the water on the blades turns the turbine to generate electricity. This concept works anywhere there's flowing water, even if it's very shallow. Three, two, one, now! That was amazing, such a small machine and it made electricity. In Japan, schools are often used as evacuation shelters during disasters. This device could provide emergency power. Sumino's generator promises to transform life in remote areas of the world that still lack power. There are many places where individuals or whole areas have no access to electricity. If we can provide them with the means to make their own power, they'll be able to change their lives. That's my hope. An ultra-small generator that could provide environmentally friendly electricity for any place on Earth where there's even a slight flow of water. <laughs>